have a look at the excitation of the heart muscle. Now this diagram is representing a simplified version of the heart. In the top, in these pink bits here, we have the top chambers of the heart, the atria. And in the bottom, we have the bottom chambers of the heart, the ventricles. <clears throat> these are representing the valves. So remember, the heart is a muscular pump that pumps blood all around the body. And within it, it has some specialised cells that can generate electrical impulses. And these electrical impulses coordinate the contraction of the heart muscle. The electrical impulse starts at the pacemaker. The pacemaker is called the sinoatrial node. We can call it the SA node for short. And the SA node stimulates an electrical impulse that goes across the atria walls. And it arrives at the AV node. The AV node, which is the atria ventricular node. And this causes the atrial walls to contract. This is atrial systole. The atria contract and they push blood from the atria into the ventricles. So this squeezing, this contraction of the atria caused by the SA node and the AV node causes the blood to move from the atria into the ventricles. There's a slight delay and that allows the blood to empty from the atria through the AV valves into the ventricles. Now, this electrical impulse continues from the AV node down some specialist fibres known as the bundle of his. It's travelling down here. They're in the septum of the heart. So these are known as the bundle of his and they connect the AV node to some other fibres called the Purkinje fibres. And the electrical impulse continues along these Purkinje fibres which go down and then up and around and through the ventricle walls. So these are the Purkinje fibres. And this electrical impulse travelling through the ventricle walls causes ventricular systole. The ventricle walls contract and they push blood out of the heart through the pulmonary artery and through the aorta, going to the lungs and to the rest of the body respectively. So we can summarise that this electrical impulse starts at the SA node. It travels across the atria walls to the AV node, which then travels along the bundle of his and then to the Purkinje fibres. And this allows the heart to control the contractions, pushing the blood through the heart and back out of the heart to where it needs to be delivered.